afraid to throw. Uh, my answers aren't good <laughs> at Affleck, so I'm afraid to throw him out there. There's Scott Proctor. Yes, he was just called up from Columbus, and there's his numbers. And his uh, last consistently. Hit well to center field. Bernie on the run is going to play it on a hop. And Crawford has a leadoff single. And he is. Pitch was low. And again, boy, they threw Lugo a lot of sliders. And that one misses. And just like that, the, I mean, the Yankees score a run just like that. The Devil Rays have two on with nobody out. Popped up. Right side playable. Sheffield in shallow right. Runners will hold their ground. And that's the first out in the top of the fourth. There they go. Flaherty's throw. Nice effort by A Rod to make the scoop and the tag. Only chance they had. I mean, John just had to try to release it as quickly as possible, but the blazing speed of Crawford. The Yankees will walk Huff and try to get a double play. Kid, if you think about it, I, I, you know, you know, Tampa Bay's bullpen is tough, uh, is not tough, and you know that you can score some runs. But right here, you're you're at a towards second, not hit hard. Oh, and Cano tried to tag Huff at the same time, gets does not get an out. Robinson Cano trying to catch the ball, tag Huff, make an inning-ending double play, got neither, and it is eight to two with the bases. Up. And him out in front of a breaking pitch. Foul territory. Alex Rodriguez will make the call. So fourth spot. Into right field. That's going to get a couple more home. Lee heading for third. Lugo and Huff score. Double figures for the Devil Rays. Ten to two in the top of the fourth. There it is right there. Cash struck out on the Proctor fastball to end the fourth inning, but the Devil Rays get three more, and they lead it 10-2. Adeki Matsui to lead it off when we come back. And you just get Wade. Here it is. Throw it in here. Throw a little batting practice. See how far they can hit it. Hit it hard. Base hit. But you'd rather do that than give up a base on balls, and you're giving up a base hit to... Probably the hottest hitter in the American League right now. And you high to right field. Is it deep enough? Huff back at the warning track. It's gonna hold up. Jason Giambi just missed a two-run homer. You know, had something going here for the first six games of his home stand. Tap toward third. Gonzalez short hop off balance throw gets birdie as Matsui advances to second. You know, oftentimes when a team is on a winning streak, you'll hear people say, well, who are they beating? They're beating the tail end teams. Well, that's who you're supposed to be. No doubt about it. I mean, the world champions are getting shilling back. A couple talk of hops. about this next inning. All right, Kenny? All right. We go to the lead. Flaherty retired. Matsui gets a base hit. Yankees have two runs and four hits through four. The Devil Rays have ten. They lead it ten to two. Here, and obviously, where the Yankees are now, and I was talking about last inning. You, you start to dig a hole, and it, it's not just with Baltimore in first place, but you don't want to get there every year. The last you know, six or seven years, that see that base hit up the middle. That you know the Yankees in Boston, whoever won, and the other one would be the wild card. But that's not the way the league's setting up this year. I mean, the American League Central ball club. Here's Lugo. Alex is strong throw to Giambi in time as Crawford advances to second. There's two away in the Devil Ray fifth. Or third. Alex with a strong arm. Gets can two by a stride. Proctor pitches a scoreless fifth. We head to the bottom of the fifth at the stadium. The Yankees still down 10 to 2. Up, yeah, we, we won in 90, and then I came back in 91, and I think then uh, he was done in 92. Into the bat with that one, out into right center. Huff over to make the catch. Incidentally, speaking of the Reds, from a baseball news standpoint, today they... Finishes, and all of a sudden, Lou Pinella got us over the hump with just bringing in the winning atmosphere. He, he, he had, you know, come to know here in New York. Jeter gets a hit as 
Gonzalez can't flag it down. Derek's two for three. But then you look at the ups and downs and what happens in New York City hit sometimes and Joy, a former MVP. Womack right up the middle. Tony got a base hit. Jeter will stop at second. And you talk about, you know, the, the hitting contrast of them. I mean, Joe Torrey was a guy who just showed up. What? Deep to left. Gone. Halfway back. It's 10 to 5. Towards short. Lugo gobble it up. Travis Lee to uh, Paul, you know how there's. <laughs> what do you mean today? <laughs> Center field, end of the bat. Hollins with a late start, and it's going to drop in for a base hit. And suddenly, what looked pretty dim for the Yankees with that little bloop single gets Giambi to the plate. Hit well. Left center field. Hollins coming on is going to play that on a hop. That's who he'll stop at second. And now Bernie Williams coming up with two on and two out. Down the right field line. That's fair. That's going to score Matt Sui. Bernie headed for second with a double. Giambi will stop at third. It's 10 to 6. And you see the Yankees up there and you see Texas up there who's yeah. also having a good year. And you don't expect teams like that to, to be in the, the worst ERA. Ball four. The tying run is coming to the plate. Would you believe it? And Lou Pinellas says, will you please go out and tell him to throw the ball over? Two. Sharply, but right at can two. Catches it off the shoe tops. So Robinson Cano hit it well, but right at can two. But this is the swing that got the Yankees back in the game. Gary Sheffield, 426 to his career. And after five, 10 to six Devil Rays. And with the Devil Rays having a couple of uh, left-handers coming up, Aubrey Huff and Travis Lee. Hey! Couple of hops out towards second. Cano gobbles it up and crosses out Aubrey Huff. Back, I, you know, and I always thought, man, I'm not getting it. I'm not getting that same pitch back. Loop toward the line. Sheffield has to play it on a hop. And Lee reaches out and taps the Stanton breaking ball into right field for a one out single. Here goes Lee. Pitch inside. Posada quick release. Got him. Wow. What a tag by Cano. <laughs> 27th game for Tanyan. And outstanding numbers. Just four walks. Wow. Line shot to left field. But I guess, you know, I mentioned the Yankee scouting reports must have said. Hops toward third. Alex will take the short way to Cano. And for the second inning in a row, Tampa Bay held scoreless. Yankees within four coming to bat in the bottom of the sixth. Derek Jeter will lead it off. Hit well, deep left center. Back is Hollins. He's looking up. It is gone. A long home run by Derek Jeter. It is home run derby night. And it's now 10-7 Tampa Bay. Hustled out an infield dribble or something, keep the inning alive. <laughs> Womack down on strikes, and he continues to struggle. I'm really surprised that Tony has not tried to drop down a bunt with his speed and the way he's struggling at the plate. Popped up into the back. Short center. Holland's got a late break, but he's got time to recover. And puts it away too. 
Well, Kitty, we just opened the book again because that looked like a slider. A little 86 mile an hour slider. Yeah. I mean, that's 85, 86, whereas fastball's 92, 93. Right field, Hoff has room near the track. And the Yankees 